Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode on the Skylord Skyblock server. I hope you guys are all doing good. I'm doing fantastic. Guys, today is episode four, and I've got a great episode planned for you. First off, we're going to be fighting some bosses, and then we're going to make the craziest, awesomest spawner possible. I should probably actually try to use English. <laughs> Anyways, guys, question of the day. With it being the end months of the year, my favorite... Uh, I was kind of wondering, what are some of your favorite holidays during the year? Do you have a certain holiday you like more than others? Let me know down in the comment section below. As always, if you guys enjoy this series and you want to see more, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. Turn on those notifications for when the videos come out. Let's get into it. All right, guys. First things first, I do want to apologize between the break, between videos. Lately, man, I don't know what's going on with myself. I have just not had motivation. Uh, feeling down almost kind of depressed man. I don't know what's going on, but I think I'm getting out of that funk finally uh, And I've only really had time for hermitcraft, but um, we are back doing good and one other quick announcement I uh, am selling a t-shirt for October uh, It's in my design by humans t-shirt store and you can find the link in the description I'm gonna put this shirt on the screen now It is the coolest shirt of all time ever it's amazing, by the way. So make sure that you check that out. And uh, I don't think my spawner. Oh, no, I was going to say my spawner is now working. Awesome. So we should have a good bit of iron in there. Fantastic. So today, to start today's episode off, we are actually going to fight the rest of these legendary bosses because they were uh, dropping spawners. Um, and we're going to we're going to go kill these guys real fast. So once we kill these guys, we'll get all of the spawners. And then we're going to expand that spawner out some, and it's going to be pretty awesome. Put that in there. So, oh my God, he already threw me in the air. Did these? How much health does this guy have? He has 400 health. That's crazy. I wish I had, oh, you know what? I wonder if I could buy one of those. Let's do slash shop. Uh, miscellaneous items? No, nah, that's not it. Mob drops? Nope. Glass. Uh, you know what? It actually might be under decor. Nope. Okay, he doesn't have any. So I was looking to see if they had any cobwebs. Because if you have a cobweb, you can sort of... Wow, rude. <laughs> if you have cobwebs, you can jump into the cobweb and do crits every single hit. And that's much faster than just killing these guys like this. But And I kind of forget what they drop, so let's go ahead and check that out. Can you spam? You can't spam. Nope. I miss 1.8 mechanics. No. There we go. So mob is dead. So what did he drop? Uh, that's a lot of stuff because I, I didn't have anything. The only thing I had in my inventory was this. So I got four cow spawners, four pig spawners, two iron golems, two chickens, and blazes. Wow. That's insane. Let's do a mythical boss. Okay, so that was the mythical boss. He must be the um, sort of the big guy of the group then because that's a lot of drops, man. And so I, I really thought that the legendary boss was better, but I think I'm wrong about that. That's a lot of spawners. That's going to increase our like money production like tenfold pretty much. That's insane. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Okay, so we'll kill this one and I'll probably do the rest of them maybe off camera. I forget. I think the other one was a blaze and I think one of them is an iron golem. Okay. Yeah, holy crap, that's a lot of, that's a lot of spawners. And then, so, let's try the legendary boss now, because I know one of these guys drops the iron golem. Oh, that's an iron golem, I don't want him to die. He's probably going to die in the little, little thing. Hold on, iron golem, I'm trying to save you so I can kill you. No, not iron golem. Hold on, hold on, got him. Let's kill him fair and square. So I'm pretty sure this is the guy who drops the iron golems, right? You know, because he's, you know, an iron golem. See what it did there? <laughs> Man, Jevin, you're uh, kind of Captain Obvious today. Hey, don't judge me, okay? Do not judge me. So we'll kill this guy real fast. I'll do the other two off camera. Um, but I just want to see what this guy drops real fast. Because according to this one, we didn't get any more iron golems. Iron golems seem to be probably one of the best mobs to kill. Ew. Oh my god. I hate that. Getting thrown in the air like that sucks. Okay, what do we get? We got two more iron golem spawners. We have a whole bunch of chicken and piggy spawners. There we go. 
So I'm gonna finish these two off camera and I'll be back. Okay guys, oh, I left blocks in there. Uh-oh. Well, anyways, <laughs> sorry. Um, so we are gonna need to expand this thing a bit. We've got a lot of spawners and I have these keys to go through still. So we've got like all of those spawners and then I've got one in there, a few in there actually. I've got chicken spawners, enderman spawner, uh, iron golem. So yeah, we've got a lot of spawners. So what we're gonna need to do, do I not have any stone brick? All right, let's go ahead and quickly buy some stone brick. I'm trying to think about how much I want to, uh, how much I want to add on to this thing, right? Um, so if we think about it, I don't know if this, I think the spawners are gonna work if it's, we're 23 blocks away. So we're gonna have to think of a clever way to maybe, you know what? Hmm. All right, I'm gonna go in there actually. Let's go in there, I need to look at it. So, let's go, do, I don't think I have a silk touch, so I'm just gonna have to fix that later. So if we're um, going to expand this, first off, let me get rid of this. So we'll get rid of that. I think if we add on, let's see, I was gonna add on a, I think we can probably scoot this over four blocks. Actually, we, let's scoot it over five blocks, right? So from here, we'll go, uh, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight from there. That way we have full water streams and I'm going to go, I may have to move it out. Mm. Here's the problem that I see, right? If I'm going to do eight on each side, I'm also going to need to do eight on this side. So we're going to need to add five on this side as well. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight and then the wall. So we'd have to bring it all the way out to there. And I'm not sure that I really want to make it that big. Hmm. I think maybe we'll just extend the side of it on each side. So we'll extend it from the, the three sides other way like that. And then from there, we should be able to fit a bunch more spawners in here. And I also think that I may actually extend it upwards too, <clears throat> so we can stack on top of each other. So I'm thinking like, so this is the top. For every one block, we could probably add a space in. So space, spawner, space, spawner, space, 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 ceiling, top ceiling. Something like that, right? So I'm thinking probably about that size, right? So that's a much, much bigger region. That should give us enough area to put a god amount of spawners in there, like a lot of spawners. <laughs> so I'm gonna get to work on this. Uh, when I come back, we'll start trying to figure out how we wanna place all these down. Okay guys, so we're over at the crates area. I have been saving my keys for a while now. So we've got six uh, of the Skylord ones. Uh, mythical, rare, and legendary. So we are going to be doing all of these suckers. Uh, not all of them right now, but I do want to see what each one is probably going to give us. So we got a spawn egg. Ooh, a legendary boss. That's awesome. So we can do it. Oh, we got another one. Is that all we get from this then? We got a hoe. We have a cell wand. Right click a chest with this wand to sell its contents. That right there, my friends, is a game changer. Because with our spawner, obviously we're gonna have a lot of loot to sell. That right there is fantastic. That's like the best thing ever. Ooh, what's this? We got a pig pet. Um, eat your fill and maintain your food saturation just like a plump, satisfied pig. Passive, unlimited saturation while in your inventory. I think that I don't have to eat now, maybe? Let's try one more real fast. That's pretty cool. Oh, I think I got another boss fight. All right, cool. Well, I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of that now because now I want to see what else I can get. I got some spawners. I got those. So this has got to be like the best one, right? That, that only makes sense. So let's do the legendary keys now, or at least a few of them. Oh, wow. We got some apples and some enchanted armor diamond. Those are probably better than what I have on actually. 
Yeah, those are actually much better. Protection for armor. So I thought I thought the other one was better, but that seems good too. Okay. We got an ender chest. Neat. Oh no, that's a tier three money pouch. Let's open that bad boy up. What are we gonna get? Oh my god. Dude, rich AF, bro. Oh, we got a sword too. Holy crap, that sword's amazing. <laughs> this is so much fun. <laughs> this is it's just like gambling. Um oh, wrong key. Wrong key. There we go. What else are we gonna get? I got a piece of bedrock and some obsidian. Interesting. I wonder what that's for. Alright, so let's go ahead and do another one. So let's do uh mythical. Let's see what we get from mythical. So we got a piece of paper, banknotes. So click on it. Okay, so I just added 150,000 to my uh, to my game. <laughs> These are all just from fighting those bosses too. So we got another money pouch. Oh wow, this one. Okay, so it, I guess it goes rare is the hardest then, or the best I would say, because we are rich AF, bro. Rich AF. Oh my god, this is so much fun. It's, it's like literally playing like the slot machine. <laughs> more iron golem spawners. Oh my goodness. I want some more of those bank notes. Dude, that helped us a ton. All right, so rare must be like primo then, right? Oh, golden apples. Maybe not. Maybe rare is like the base one then. We got eight hoppers. Yeah, this is definitely like the base one. And a whole bunch of spawn eggs. Okay, what else do I have left? I want to do some more of these legendary ones. Shoot. I think my inventory is full, though. Um, Here, let me drop some stuff. I don't want wolves. Don't want horses. I'll keep sheep, chicken, mushrooms, and cows. I don't want the seed, sugar, wheat, that, that. Oh, I do want those spawners. Crap. Sorry, guys. There we go. Um, so you, you, uh, you, you, and it's my stone brick. I can buy obsidian. There we go. So let's do these, these legendary keys real fast. More spawners. What are those spawners? Pig spawners. Okay. And then we got, I think we got more pig spawners. Awesome. Okay, guys, so I'm going to save these rare keys. I'm going to head back over to the island now. Look at this beast. Oh, my goodness. It took forever to build, by the way. We're going to do something with this pathway because I'm not a fan. So upstairs we go. And if we go this way. So this is our, like, little area. So I'm thinking that the way we're going to handle this, like, let's try a cow spawner first. So I'll put a cow spawner here and here. Oh, really? That is fantastic. I did not know you could do that. So you can, oh, maybe you can't stack them. Am I losing them as we go? No, I'm not losing them. So I can't even shift above that though. Can, oh, so you can't put another block above that then? Interesting, so can I go here then? So I can't even, put, I can, oh. You know what? Um, I don't think I'm in my island anymore. Hold on. So if I'm right here, this land right here is where I'm out of my island. So can I place it from here then? No. Huh. I wonder why I can't place that down. It, uh, it says cow spawner placed. Oh, so if you place the spawners down, it just collects them into a bunch of spawners. Interesting. So, um, all right, so let's try this again then. Let's try it with the chicken spawner. Can I place outside of my range? I don't think anybody would be smart enough to grief me. So that places all that right there. And you know what I just realized? I re <laughs> this could be a problem. Hold on real fast. I need to do exclamation point shop. I guess that would be under farming. Mm, miscellaneous buys. There we go. Confirm. I need to go grab some signs. All of my cows and stuff, although they're not going to move, there's no killing mechanism underneath of there. 
So is there a sign? Grab a sign. I'm gonna need like seven more signs. Let me... I don't see any more. Oh, there they are. All right, cool, cool. So... Yeah, there's, they're definitely starting to build up. How many cows are there? Put all those in there. All right, so I'm going to do it too high like before. That way when I place the golems down, they die. There we go. Place the lava there. So that should stop everything from flowing in. Perfect. So then let's see if they die. They should die, right? Yes. Okay, so that's going to be a little bit of a problem, but I don't see that being too much of an issue. Put all that in there. Okay, so now that we've got that kind of taken care of, I don't think we're going to be able to place the blaze spawners down. I do want to um I do want to place some more pigs though. Or more, or start placing pigs. Sorry, not placing more. There we go. I really like some of the features of the server. I, uh, I wish I would have known about this stacking first, though. I guess it doesn't really matter if it's in the corner or not. So one block off the edge over here. So the only one that we're really missing is sheep. So get all of those in there. Cool. And then I want to put slabs over top of this. It won't let me place slabs on top of that. You can't even place it in the same block. I think that'll still spawn mobs, though. I think they only need a one by one. Can I place? I don't think I can place glass over it either. All right. So the main one that we're going to be doing, though, is these iron golems. And they're going to sit right in the middle. So get all of those. Villager Golem. So place all those down. Okay, so we have tons of spawners. Um, let's go to exclamation point shop spawner. So we need a sheep spawner. How much are they? 20,000? Let's buy like 10 of them. So... Yeah, that wasn't that expensive. I can't really see my chat, but it looks like 200,000. Okay. I wonder if it spawns um, like certain colors or if it's like random. Okay, so let's get rid of all of this pathway here. And then we'll go downstairs and kind of check everything out. So I'm really, really curious to test out this uh, cell wand. This thing is going to be amazing. this nonsense all right cool so we are down you you and you and uh i'll come back and fill this in in a little bit is our let's just say is our inventory already that full i guess we're probably gonna have to put two more hoppers in um just to be 100 percent safe let me grab some hoppers real fast if there's any in here no idea where i got a wood axe from <laughs> whatever <laughs> okay that's weird that it's not going into the hoppers i wonder if that's just like some kind of weird glitch like some visual glitch or something maybe let's let him die though oh i want that uh that cell wand let me grab the cell wand real fast is it in here yeah right there Okay. I'm, I'm very curious as to why my items aren't going in there. Is the hopper full? The hopper's full. Why is the hopper full? The hopper's 100% pointing into this chest. I'm confused. Uh, what? My hoppers are not moving items? Interesting. So I just sold everything in there for $2,300. Sell it again. That one was $1,700. That's, this thing is the best thing ever. All right, guys. So I built a little bridge, right? I'm not sure if I like it, though. 
Let me know what you guys think. So basically, it's three wide. I'm actually considering changing the cobblestone to dirt, though. Let me check and see if I have any dirt up here. Uh, not really. Not really. I might have some in the chest over here, though. Perfect. So, uh, yeah, it's three wide. And what I'm going to eventually do is build a little island over here. I wanted to make a pathway to this because all we had was that just like little grass road. This could work though. So I just want your opinion. Should I continue the grass maybe? Let's take a look at it from the side. Uh, I really, I kind of like the detail I put into it a little bit. So essentially it's got wood stairs underneath of the oak there. And then we've got stairs, slabs, and then the cobblestone just goes all the way across. Now, it does kind of look like a cool little bridge. I'm not going to lie. It's, it's kind of growing on me. Oh, no, the server's going to restart. Uh, anyways, guys, I do think that's probably going to take care of today's episode. So I hope everybody has a great day. Thank you all for watching, and please leave me some feedback on this, gang. As always, this is Ijevin. Peace out.